The difference between a factory bike and a custom bike is you can go to a little book and look it up and it tells you everything that you, uh, that you want to know about what's going on with that bike. Uh, custom bike, there's no manual that says when this is fucked up, you've got to put this in. The guys from up north aren't like the guys from down south and the guys from the west coast aren't like the guys from the east coast. You know, with 10 guys working here, bumping heads is, is probably a uh, day in, day out thing. Here you walk in and go, hey Trent, what's going on? Oh, nothing. Chino stabbed Rusty in the neck and Shorty's in prison, but same old thing. I counterbalance for it. I would be considered the bad cop and he'd be considered the good cop. He'd be the one, you know, comforting you, making you feel comfortable and stuff, and I'm gonna be the one going, no, you're lying to me, you're telling me the wrong things, you know. I'm the kind of person that really cares about my job and the company, and I'm a workaholic. What makes all that a bad thing is that I've been married and I have a kid and an ice cream home that I never see any of. There is no typical customer. You get everybody from doctors, lawyers, down to hardcore bikers. You get somebody who wants to think it over, you take them over to the bar, buy them a beer, they think about it, and of course the more they drink, the quicker the sale's gonna be. <laughs> My dad is Rick Fairless, and I've been hanging around Easy Riders or Strokers for ever since I was about 12. Well, one time my boyfriend brought me roses and my dad was like, who's this guy? What is he doing with my baby? And he's like, well, if they want to hold hands, tell them to come up here. They can hold my hand. When employees want to borrow money, they used to go to him. Yes, sir. Um, my cat died and I need $100. Oh, one second. I don't like cats. What else you got? Are you asking me to borrow money? Yes, sir. Is that what you're asking? Yeah. And then the next day he'd say, I don't know what came over me but I loaned so-and-so some money, and I said, okay, for stop right there. How much would you like? Oh, 50 bucks. How about 40? You got it. From now on, if they want to borrow money, you tell them, come see Redheaded Sherry. Okay, buddy, you pay me back when? Uh, Wednesday. I stopped that totally. <laughs> they just come right to me. I'm not supposed to. My office manager gets mad at me for doing that. <laughs>